Hi, my name is Erin Connor and I am Miss Vermont 2017. I first got involved with the Epilepsy Foundation of Vermont in 2010 when I was Miss Vermont's Outstanding Teen and I was selling some raffle tickets at a Lake Monsters game and Audrey, our executive director, had come up to me and told me a little bit about the organization and I was instantly hooked on everything that they were trying to do for the community. Um, this organization has such a sense of family and a strong bond and um, I immediately got a hold of Audrey right after that game and said, you know, I want to learn more and I want to be part of this organization and I want to help those who are affected by epilepsy um, and the families who are affected by it as well. And it just so happened that that year, my oldest brother was diagnosed with um, grand mal seizures epilepsy. And it just seemed to come really full circle that, you know, I was, Audrey was brought into my life during that time. And ever since then, I have sat on the board with the directors and um, I've gone out in the community and I've helped Audrey at events and promoted um, this organization and what they do for this community and how incredible they are. The Epilepsy Foundation of Vermont has a lot of resources that the state of Vermont uses. Um, they have a lot of programs where they send kids to camp for a week on a full scholarship. Um, they have programs for nurses in schools. The Epilepsy Foundation of Vermont also offers some MFIT monitors for those who have epilepsy um, and some monitor that goes under the bed um, to kind of monitor how that person's sleeping and it really gives the family a peace of mind knowing that they can you know, sleep peacefully at night knowing if their loved one does have a seizure they will be alerted and can kind of um, come and help them out. And another amazing service that the Epilepsy Foundation of Vermont offers is a training service for people who want to learn about epilepsy, more about it and how to care for their loved one if they do have a seizure. The Institute of Medicine conducted a study and found that 1 in 26 people will develop epilepsy at some point in their life. 1 in 26. That is such a drastic number. So here at the Epilepsy Foundation of Vermont, we really want to try and um, bring awareness about this issue and tell people, you know, make sure you're wearing your seatbelt and helmet. Safety is so, so important. The Epilepsy Foundation of Vermont has a wide variety of events that we've put on throughout the entire year. And if you're looking to get involved, you can go onto our Facebook page, Epilepsy Foundation of Vermont, or you can go to our website, epilepsyvt.org or epilepsy at sover.net.